Are you gonna put flour in that? Boy, what are we? of it, Home on the Range. All right. Okay. All right. Well, tonight we have a very, very special recipe because this recipe was sent to us by one of the producers on the home show. You know, we're on the home show every Wednesday morning on ABC, and this is Nora Efron's recipe for tiramisu. Wrong. Why? Are you not following the recipe that I gave you? Yes, I am, but I want to show you right here. Right here. The recipe is on the box here. Right here. It's on the box right here. Tiramisu pick me up. Same right. recipe, exactly same recipe. She stole it. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm sorry to interrupt. Go ahead. I, I don't want to. You were saying, Barbara. They told me it was Nora Ephron's recipe. Okay, I'm gullible. What they, can I say? They lie. Okay. All right, so we are going to attempt to make tiramisu. And, you know, tiramisu is a very hot dessert right now because of... Uh, Sleepless in Seattle. Did you see that movie? No, but I was supposed to. I was, I was, I was uh, ordered to go see it, but I, didn't, I haven't had time. Well, you take directions so well. You told me about it, though. <clears throat> yes, and there's a, there's a scene in it where they talk about tiramisu, and tiramisu is what they call a lover's dessert. Do you know my son, Andy, the restaurateur? Villanova, in has Newport a Villanova. Beach. He, he's had that on his menu for 25 years, and since the movie came out, everybody is asking for it. Really? He gets four dollars and a half for a serving of it. <laughs> it's a lot of money. It's a lot of money. Okay, well, we're going to show you how to make tiramisu tonight. How do we do this? Well, we start with four eggs. We separate four eggs. We take the yolks from the whites. Okay. Now, you're not going to do it this time, because remember what happened well, last time? Well, I know, time? but you know what? Wait, wait, wait. Don't do Barbara, this. Barbara, so what? You're not in the right place. We're, we're, we're in the right place. This is the garage, no, isn't no, it? No, no, look. Here. <laughs> Oh, boy. Now you're in the right place. Really? There's a well, camera right here. Well, we have our right Busby here, Berkeley see. camera, and you're not using yeah, it. Yeah, but the camera's over here, and we're going to be over no, here. No, it's over here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Are we on that monitor? Can you see us? Okay. Thank you, you very much. Oh, boy. When we almost, we we almost time, messed that one up. Look at We got some yolk in the white. That's okay. Here. Just take it right out. Because it won't, it won't whip if it's in there. No. You're getting your fingernails dirty, Barbara. I know. Well, I have to make some sacrifices. All right. She didn't get it all out, but we'll, we'll see what happens here. I'll get a spoon. All right. Here. Oh, look. my gosh. <laughs> she didn't see that. You know, I am so glad he's doing this, because if <laughs> I was doing this, he'd be just calling me dumb. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> okay, now, all right. <laughs> That's, that's really trick, isn't it? I think now, that this, this vacation you were on just kind of... No, it worked well. Did you see it well? All right. Okay, so what's this? This okay. is the yolk part, though. This goes in here. See? No, Barbara, no. Are okay. you in Let pain? me have that. Let me have that. Okay. All right. Now, we're going to put the yolk in here. Mm -hmm. We've got to rinse this out. Okay. And then what happened? What, what? happened to the water? <clears throat> Did we not pay the water bill? You know I have this trouble in the morning once in a while. <laughs> well, well, I don't know. <clears throat> My nose is running. Okay, now, all right. Oh, we got to leave this over here. Give okay. me this. Yeah, we. You know we've been off for a couple of weeks. Well, we've been off longer than that, but. Uh, <laughs> So this is, uh, this is brandy. Now, I want to tell you about this dish. I would never normally make this on this show because it's very expensive. Because this bottle of brandy cost, I don't know, $5, I think. It was a lot. And, and we've got to put a half. No, we don't need the spoon. We've got to put a half a cup in there. Yeah, about a half a cup. Ah, a little more. OK, all right, all right. Now, we've got to stir that up. Do you okay, want to stir that up? OK, I can stir it. Now don't, now, don't throw it out of the pan. Just stir no. it up. Just stir it up, OK. And then this we're is not put... my regular stirring spoon, sir. 
Can I have my regular spoon? Which spoon do you stir with? This one? No, I like the long one. This is, we don't have a stove on, Barbara. I know, but this seat, the, the other one is just nicer. This has got burning stuff on it. Plus, it doesn't match my nails this week. All right. Thanks. Oh, boy. Okay. Now. Ooh, this is really ugly. Stir, uh, get, uh, stir it up. I'm stirring. Oh, here, I'm here's the thing to stir it with. Stir it up with this. This is the thing to stir it up with. You're going to splash it all over with that. No, that won't splash, see? That won't splash at all. That's a tip. Is that a tip? That's a tip. Okay, what are you putting in here now? This is the um, ma mascarpone cheese. Mascarpone cheese. Marsipone, isn't Marsipone. it? Marsipone. Marsipone, that's is right. It? Marsipone, okay. yes. It comes. We were fighting about this it before comes, the no. show started. No. Who knows how to pronounce this? Mars. No, mascarpone. Mars. Mascarpone. No. Says that right. No. The lady in the front row said mascarpone. Mars but I know because it comes from from mascarpone goats. The milk from mascarpone goats that are really? they're raised in northern Italy, just south of Verona. Yeah. Yeah. You also told me that brown eggs come from brown chickens. Get that out. There. Oh, you can't. No, you can't use that now. Oh, stop. No, because look, stop, now Barbara. it's honking on here. Barbara, no, you can't use that now with it, Barbara. With the cheese out. You no. Know, with the cheese, you can't use that. See no, if you look, can get, now it's all stuck in the middle. See if you can get that out of there. All right. Because we got to have two of these. Oh, jeez. Barbara, don't, don't, no. come on. Okay, we come got on. it. Now, now, squish that. Now, now you, now you like that. Yeah, okay. Oh, boy. Okay, we're squishing. Now, this stuff here was $10 a pound for this cheese. Really? Yeah. Whoa, this has got Those to really bother you to go to pay this amount of money for the recipe. And I can't even get the lid off here. These are, those are, those are mighty fancy goats, I'll tell you. Here, here, here. You here. squish it like okay. this, see? Oh, oh, okay. You know what? I now, here. I have a better method. Barbara, okay, we've wait. only got 21 minutes. Okay, okay. I like Watch. this, see? Watch. See, like this. See, like this. Just keep doing that, and it'll, and it'll be all right. Oh, boy. This way it goes faster. You know, I made this this afternoon. It took me about five minutes with really? no, no help. <laughs> Boy, at $10 a pound, we want to get it all in there. Yeah, let's get it all in there. All right. There's some more you on know, the outside. My there. grandmother was Italian, and I don't remember her making this kind of stuff. I hope she didn't. Boy. Okay. We got to get. Is... Oh, good. The water is fixed. Oh, good. Boy, I wonder if I could. Well, okay. All right. Okay, what's next? You got to get that stirred up good. It's stirred. It's not stirred. You got to stir it up good. It's kind of when, when, when you get it, when you get it stirred to where the, the cheese is, is, is mixed into the, the stuff, then you can use this because it's got to be stirred good. You know, they have electric mixers. Yeah, I'm going to use it right now. I mean, this is the 90s. This is the, this is the egg white. Women don't have to do this kind we're of putting, stuff we're anymore. We're putting the egg white. Now, it's going to make a lot of noise. We're putting the egg white and a half a cup of sugar. You know, for the recipe, you need to get the egg whites semi-stiff, and then you keep adding the, um, the sugar until it gets very stiff. Did Don't say stiff. That? Don't say stiff. This is a family show. <laughs> right. Look, you know, you're all what? done with these. You're all done with these. Now you can use the you can use a whisk and oh, okay. that's got that's got to be mixed thoroughly. You know, now. that's an art to know okay. when to change oh, utensils. No. Oh. That really is. That comes from years of cooking. Well, I'm glad the water came back on. That's sure. Look at that. All right. Okay. This is doing beautiful. Things aren't whipping. It's not whipping? No, no. What, hap what happened to all our towels? Oh, here they are. <laughs> Barbara. This is awful. Ah, ah. Taste that. You did something wrong. No, no, no. no this Trust is, me. This is wonderful. You did something wrong. You know, I did something wrong coming on this dumb show. <laughs> Oh. All right. Now just just mix it slowly. Well, it's Take smooth. it easy. Ooh, it's smooth. How all much right. smoother could it be? Isn't but, this smooth? Yeah, but smooth? not all over the kitchen. Yay! Oh. It's smooth. No. Oh. It's smooth. He just leaves me here so I have something to do. You know, I if you get a little that. yolk in the in the white, it don't mix good. That's what's happening. You got we, yolk in the white. You, you did. I did. You did. You did, I saw you. Well, if 
it's not stiff, no one will know the difference. You know what? We'll just put it in and we'll <laughs> say it true. was stiff. <laughs> look, at, look at him laugh. He knows. <laughs> he knows. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. So what are the rest of the ingredients to this? Uh, well, we're going we're gonna to fold this in. Now, this has all the sugar in with that. And then we're going to put it in a pan. That's not what I asked you. <laughs> what is all the rest this of is this ingredient? This is chocolate. You want to hold it over under the camera? Good. Chocolate. The semi-sweet chocolate that I grated. But that's not what the recipe it, says. In the, yes, it did. In the Cuisinart. It says shaved chocolate. Where's the recipe, Barbara? No, what the one you printed. The one you printed. The one I printed. Anybody got... Big Al, can I get a recipe? All right. All right. There's a recipe right there. All right, all right, all right. All right, now, right here. Shaved. And I quote, take one, two, three, semi-sweet chocolate grated. G-R-A-T-E-D, grated. All right. Well, I typed it wrong. Okay. It's supposed to be shaved. All right. And what are these? What are these? Thank you. <laughs> Lady fingers. I got to tell you a funny story. When I first faxed him this recipe, he says to me, I don't this understand this. Good. I said, why? He goes, how come there's candy in this recipe? I said, what do you mean? He goes, well, butter fingers. I go, I don't know, yeah. Lady fingers. He goes, Lady fingers, butter fingers. It's all the same. Now, okay, this now, is, we're gonna, now we're going to fold this in. Let's just make believe you, they're Remember stiff. you had your folding lesson last week? Yes. You know how to fold? Yes. All right. But now this is supposed to be in high, you know, really, but it, it because you had that little bit of because you had that little bit of yolk in there, it didn't get really stiff. It didn't get really stiff, and so, so that's. <laughs> this is a rough crowd tonight. Okay, all right. Now you now fold that in. Yeah, you fold that in. All right. That's a very different technique. Absolutely. Yeah. Lady in front says, "Don't bother. Just mix it up." No. Which? What does she know? Okay, we're folding this. You're, you're doing good. I guess Not maybe right. there's. Have you made this before? What? Okay. Now, what? What have you got in here? Okay. What is all this stuff? Oh, that's all my paperwork. Okay. Sorry. All right. All right. This is clean. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Terrific, terrific. Can I taste it now again? Yeah, now it's going to be altogether different. Taste it. Isn't that nice? No, it's not any better. Huh? Isn't that nice? <laughs> Isn't that nice? Huh? Well, no, it's got to be good. Oh, that is wonderful. That really is. No, it really is. It's terrific. It's terrific. Pan is too big. We're not supposed to have those kind of remarks from the audience. Didn't you tell them? <laughs> Didn't you tell them? Okay, so should I add more? Not yet, not oh, yet. Okay. Not yet, not yet, not yet. Because we have to put these cookies in here. Okay, well what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this on our Busby Berkeley camera. All right, all So right, you can, right. so that the audience at home can see. And this is the, this is the grated, the grated semi-sweet chocolate. Okay? Okay, can okay. I do some? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh, my apron's all twisted. You're, you're, you're twisted, I know. Okay, oh, oh, hey, what's the matter? These aren't breaking up. Yeah. This is wrong. Now, these, are the, these wait, are the lady fingers. Wait, you know what? This is wrong. What's wrong? Can I tell you why? Tell me. I According won't listen. According to the recipe, you're supposed listen, to dip the me. lady fingers in coffee. You're absolutely right. You're absolutely right. All right, here we go. But you're not supposed to saturate them. You're absolutely right. This is the coffee right here. And we do it just like this. And give no, me my no, coffee no, back. they're supposed to be, no, give, give me my no, coffee you back. did that wrong. What did you're I do wrong? You're supposed to have one side, then the other. You're supposed to, like, dip these honkers in here like that. Uh-oh. <laughs> there we go. When you do that, like it just is gone. No! That's how you're supposed to do it. These people are really watching. But you know, the, the chocolate really isn't supposed to go now. The chocolate's supposed to go last. I was making a mistake at first. That's why I rewrote the recipe there, because it says exactly how you do it, how you do it. Now, oh boy. Adding more of these. This is the uh, mixture with the egg whites and the sugar. Yes. And the marsipone cheese. And if the egg whites were stiff, there'd have been a lot more stuff here. <laughs> well, you know what, if it was a smaller pan, though, it would look like there was more. Well, I had, the smaller pan is in the refrigerator. 
Oh, okay. Because that's the one we got to show them uh, finished. Oh, so we do have a finished product. Yes, we have a finished one. Did you really make this finished product, or did you go buy this? No, I made it. I made it in about 10 minutes. Without help, it goes fast. No, this is really good stuff. Okay, though. but you should spread it around. Boy, I almost, almost got her hand out of there, but, well, okay. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Okay. Now what do we do? We put, some, we put the rest of the chocolate on. Can I do that? No. <laughs> You're the stirrer, remember? No, but there wasn't a whole lot to stir in this recipe. Well, when you learn how to stir good, then I'll let you start doing other things, see? <laughs> Uh-oh. You know, they let now, women drive and vote now. Yeah, I know. There was an automatic transmission that really ruined this country, you know that? <laughs> Boy. And then, it came, and then it came along with the automatic washing machine, and that really did it in. Oh. Were you around when that first happened? Mm. No, but I know when they let them vote, was, that was when it all started. Okay, so this looks like it's finished. Yes, it is. We put this in the refrigerator now. Mm -hmm. Now, that's another difference on the, uh, on, the, on the box. It says for one hour, your friend at uh, ABC said uh, 24 hours. Oh. So they probably got a lot more time there than you have. <clears throat> Well, how about, you're on my cords. Now, why did you do this? Uh, to show did the I finished to, product. Did I ask you to do this? No. <laughs> All right. Now, see this, I didn't have two pans the same size. This is the proper size pan, see? But this is all done. But it doesn't look any different than this, does it? No. A little bit. A little bit. Now, this is the way it is. This is the way you can make it, that's the way you can make it without help. And this is with help. All right. All right, now okay. be careful. Now we need that in the well, morning. That's now we need that in the morning. Oh, okay. So let's don't, you know, we do have a camera up there. You remember? All right. Okay, we'll put it back in here. All right. Now, can I go? Are, are we finished? Another successful dish. We're out of here. Come on! <laughs> okay. South of Los Angeles, you'll find a TV cable access show that's found the recipe for national recognition. What do you get when you mix a crazy cook with very little talent and a rather ditzy partner whose specialty is stirring? Well, a menu for TV success, that's what, and you'll find it only in Hollywood. You ought to see what's cooking in this Orange County, California garage. And you can if you have access to Newport Beach's cable access channel. Welcome to the garage and another edition of At Home on the Range. It's a half-baked cooking show called At Home on the Range. I'll pass on the oh. dog food. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. No, it's actually pretty good. Mm. <laughs> there are limits I'll go with you. <laughs> no, with a little ketchup, this would be wonderful. Okay. <laughs> John Crean is an offbeat billionaire who made his fortune selling Fleetwood Mobile Homes. He just happens to love to cook. No, so one was supposed to make stuff rise and the other makes it doughier, and I don't remember which was which. Boy, if I could get something that would make things rise, I'd be interested in that. <laughs> I think the show is dumb, but people seem to like it, like it so I, what can I say? I don't know anything about cooking, which is painfully obvious on the show. And so he had to give me something to do, so he made me the stirrer. And then people started writing in saying, we love how you stir. And it just got to be a thing. I didn't know that there was an art to stirring, but there's a lot of different techniques, and I know about it. Just give me one technique. What do you okay. do? Okay, there's, there's, the, there's the slow stir. Okay, that's the really slow stir. And then there's, when you have the heat too high, you have to get really quick. And then your whole body shakes as you do it. Okay. And then... My body doesn't shake like your body uh, shakes. <laughs> Could that be another reason people are watching? <laughs> Maybe. His friend and stir-crazy sidekick, Barbara Venezia, talked him into doing this cooking show from his garage. Well, one of his 18 garages attached to this Tara-like mansion. Now we have 30, 37 <laughs> bathrooms. Oh, you do not. No, yeah, 37 bathrooms. 37 toilets. 37. Some of the bathrooms have more than one toilet. Do you have a bladder problem? No, 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 no. But I have a lot of friends. Each week, about 40 fans cram into the garage to watch John and Barbara cook. 
well, burn, spill, and basically fumble through recipes. I steal most of them, just, you know, out of books and stuff. And, uh, and we don't give anybody any credit, though. We just steal them. But their followers don't seem to mind. Now, why would you come out and watch this? Because they're absolute experts. Mr. Crean is, there's none better, and his helper. You can't beat a person with all that talent. Well, I know. So it's just perfect. Have you been feeling all right? Well, I had a little of that cake, and there was brandy in it. Well, I might learn something. Not, not really. <laughs> no, no, but totally educational. Oh, really? You yes. learned something? Oh, absolutely. How to stir. Instead of the garlic cloves, which are hard to take apart and peel and everything, we use this. And that use looks for... like glue. That's garlic, okay? Oh, that is the worst unappetizing thing I have Just ever right. seen. <laughs> it reminds me of my pet bird. <laughs> We're like an accident. You want to turn away, but for some reason you can. <laughs> well, now the ABC television network has come knocking on the garage door. They have signed John and Barbara to do cooking segments for their daytime talker, The Home Show. I didn't know what The Home Show was, and Barbara called me telling me about it, though. She was so excited. She, she didn't know what she, whether she's coming or going. I think yeah. she's beating her pants. Really, really? really? Not bad for a little cable show starring a chef most call a questionable cook. By the second or third day, I was using Alka-Seltzer as a beverage. So now, all of America can learn to make really bad food. I think they're ready for us. I think they've been ready for us. I think we cook like most people do, which is frightening. Okay, we're out of here until next week. Bye. Bye, -bye. <laughs>